Hey guys and welcome to the vlog. Today I'm here uh, starting in, um, uh, I think it's the, um, the biggest like corn maze around here. I think it's actually in New Jersey and we're here. Uh, they said it would take around between um, what, one hour and a half and two hours to complete so it's gonna be a while. We just started like what, one minute ago or something like that. Uh, we're probably gonna get lost. But, no, that, that's, that's part of the maze. Apparently this makes a bunch of shapes on the top and like characters and figures and stuff. So yeah, we can't really see what it's like. I thought about bringing the drone, but it was probably gonna, it wasn't probably gonna be the best because we couldn't even check what we're doing. But um, yeah, we just got a new drone yesterday. We got the DJI Phantom 2. So that will be um, some cool videos for you guys. Um, I don't know where they went, but yeah. Where's the boy? Where's daddy? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Um, we we just finished eating, and uh, now we just came to the corn maze. Um, we're gonna try to find our way around, and after this, we're gonna go to uh, pumpkin picking to get our pumpkins for Halloween, so we can decorate it, and put, and uh, then we have to carve them when we get home and stuff. We're here with our cousins. Now, um, guys, wait. Yeah, we have to go so because yeah. Um. So yeah, we have to carve them. I don't know what we're doing yet with the faces and stuff. I bet like my dad and the kids are gonna try and scare us like most of the time because there's a bunch of spots to hide. Like you can just crawl in that over there and then uh, yeah, you can just hide in there. And then when you see them walking by, you can just go like boom. And then uh, people here freak out a lot. Especially because you're like, it's so quiet in here. You can't really hear apart from each other. So yeah. I've seen a couple of people around, but there's not too many people. Because this is so big that it's going to be hard to find a lot of people. Okay, everybody's is like trying to run away and stuff. Um, you're going to try and get through. I don't really know what we're going to do. Um, yeah, just find our way around, I guess. That's all we can do here. Um, yeah, not too much else to do. Alex, this way, they came back. Let's get him! Polo! Polo! Come on guys! That's how we get lost in Andrew. We just in a bunch of circles, so we're just wasting our time here. Now, um, oh, we just found out that was a circle over there. Oh, this leads to the same place that we just were. And now I don't know. We could either go right, left, or that left. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, let's just go this way. I don't know. Yeah. Th there's not really a right way. <laughs> we just guess. I don't really know. Three ways. Three ways. Here. Left. Sure. I think we've been here. I don't know. Yeah, we did. Oh, oh. Where are cows hauling? Tell him a cow. There's a house. There's a house. There's a house. In Kunderam, Staki. We made it. We made it. Yeah, the exit. We made it. She said an hour or so. Uh, I started recording like five minutes after. Uh, uh, seven. Uh, that that was around 15 minutes that we were there for, and they said it was an hour or something. So that was pretty quick. It's like right here, and I don't know if you guys can hear me because the music's really loud.
finished looking at the farm. Now we're gonna go on the um, on the tractor. The tractor's coming right now. We're about to go to uh, get our pumpkins and stuff. We're gonna pick them. And uh, yeah, not, not only pumpkins, they also have like other things. But yeah, mostly for pumpkins. We, uh, we can decorate them for Halloween. We just looked at the farm. We saw a lot of animals like pigs, cows. You guys saw them like chickens. What else? Um, goats rabbits and stuff a lot of animals you could see so um, yeah that was pretty cool to see all that uh, i don't know if i told you guys yet but this is the biggest farm in new jersey like the not the biggest farm but the biggest uh, cornfield is over there uh, the track is coming right now right there so we can go to um get our pumpkins so yeah pretty excited for that um i uh, we always do this every single year for halloween and it's uh, really cool i, I love going to this farm it's different from like living in the middle of the city. There's a bunch of houses and everywhere. It's just, you can just do whatever you want. Pumpkins here. Pumpkin yeah, we just took some pictures over there too. Um, so yeah. Oh, we got this one over here, which doesn't look that bad. And then we got this one, which is like taller. But, uh, this one's heavier than the other one. There's a bunch of stuff in here. Yeah, we just been here for I don't know, 10 to 20 minutes just picking out our pumpkins. Because uh, yeah, most people came already here. So uh, most of uh, good pumpkins are already picked. So we just picked them. Um, Closest ones to being good. They, they had a bit of dirt and stuff, but that we can wash off. But the other ones that we found that were good, then we turned them around. There was like holes in them, or they were like they, they were like green and they were changing color and stuff. So it wasn't that good. Uh, so um, these are the best ones we found. Um, we we're gonna head back now to the to the sorting area where we have like the, the corn maze and stuff, and um, yeah, to uh, wrap up our day. Go home. My best friend's coming today, so maybe I'll record a bit of that too. We'll go outside and do something. I don't really know, but yeah. Well, I don't think we're gonna be uh, setting these pumpkins up today, though. Maybe next weekend or something we can set them up. Uh, as I said, uh, I'll do try to do a video every week. So this is the one you guys should be seeing this either Monday or Tuesday, something like that. And uh, yeah, this was actually on Sunday that we're recording this. So yeah, um, yeah, I'm gonna try and do a video a week because. Um, we have a school and that I don't really have time. I have time to record, but we don't really go places. And then when, and, but then editing takes a couple of hours, and I still need to study and do homework for exams and stuff like that. So I don't really have time to do to record and edit and vlog in one day. So it's really hard, and I have to go to bed early. School starts really early too. So yeah, I don't really have time to do all that stuff. But I'll just record on the weekends when we go to uh, some places. Even if we don't go like any cool places, I'll just record for just for the sake of it. Because um, yeah, well, it makes us want to do go outside and do stuff at home. So yeah, vl vlogs are a good way. If you're always inside okay, and you want to go outside, just start a vlog and then yeah, you just go. It makes you want to go to places so your vlogs like cool and you have stuff to show. Because if you're just at home, like hey guys and stuff like that. Um, yeah. If you go to places, it's going to be more interesting and then more people watch it. And uh, it makes you want to go places. Then you also have uh, a lot of memories for the future if you want to go. If you want to like um, look back how you were like 10 years from now, it'll be cool to see all of this. Even for my brother since he's younger, you can see all the changes that happened to the um, to us and see how we've grown and uh, or uh, what we liked, where we went, stuff like that. And maybe we can come here like 10 years in the future. And uh, this will be, this place will be shut down or even completely different. It'll be cool to see. And the corn maze apparently changes every day, like the design of it. So maybe in 10 years when we come back, the design will be like something else. Because every year it changes stuff. So. It's really cool how they do the design of the town. There's no, there's no good way to see it. And I don't think they allow drones because we tried to bring in. The, yeah, we just decided not to bring because most of them don't let you in. So we... So I don't really know how we would see the design. They only posted the design like a couple of weeks after this closes again, after Halloween. So we don't know what the design is yet. 
but we can see the design for the past like um, six, seven years. So it was really cool to see. So in here we wrap up the day at the farm. Um, it was a pretty nice day. We just bought the pumpkins. We also bought like uh, we also bought a water because we were out thirsty and we ran out of water. We drank all all the water that we had. There's a generator in the background, so that's why you guys probably can't hear me that well. But yeah, in the car park before we came, this is all filled, filled, filled. Like to the brim, we couldn't even like walk. Now, now there's like no cars here. So we're about to go home. We're gonna pick up my best friend, either at his game or um, uh, if it's not at his game, we'll pick him up at um, at his cousin's house because uh, his cousin was the one that brought him to the game. And then after that, he brings him, um, and uh, we called him saying if we weren't there at time, so they'll just bring it to their house and they'll just pick him up there. He's gonna sleep at our, at our house, and then uh, we were in the same school, so you can, uh, so my mom will bring us both to school. In, uh, in the morning tomorrow and uh, yeah it's gonna be pretty cool because uh, he's never slept here from Sunday to Monday before and we've never gone to school together and uh, yeah in the morning is gonna be probably like a pain and stuff because we all work at our own pace and he's um he's really bad at waking up and shit so yeah but yeah pretty cool we're just uh, about to get in the car it's around a 15 minute drive to our house then we have to pick him up so it's a little like 10 minutes or something so it's not that it's easy it's pretty quick compared to the other drives that we do around like hours and stuff so it's a pretty quick quick drive 